Ready? I am recording. You heard? Yeah. Hey, welcome to another episode. I'm back at it with uh, special guest Willie. black flies out of his eyeballs. Okay. You should, you're going to see that on the video. That, that, I, that, was like, that clip when you said, <laughs> There's already like three bloopers just right now already, so. Um, take uh, six. Hey, welcome to another episode. I'm back at it again with uh, special guest Willie. Hello there. We're at uh, like an early 1900s dump today digging around a little bit. So, so far we got uh, this little bottle in the hole. That's a Braville. And that was uh, for making stews. I guess adding kind of flavor to stews and they still sell that today. So far I got uh, this little milk glass. And this uh, food jar some sort. Nothing too fancy. <laughs> now we didn't actually pull it out of the hole yet, but I... Another milk glass. Smaller. Screw top and some kind of octagonal. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's got some fancy names on it. That is pretty fancy. A lot fancier than you usually see. Needs. I, I don't it might be nades, yeah. Nades, massage cream, that's cool. An embossed milk glass, that's definitely a keeper. And it's like he's small enough to be on my keeper list. Yeah, Willie only likes the small bottles. So Willie was digging around, he told me that he felt something embossed underneath there. So, this is what came up. A chunk of a broken carbolic acid poison bottle. That's uh, complete. That's a bottle digger's dream right there. And I was scraping on this side here. And this guy... This guy popped out here. Embossed? It is. A wood, uh, it is. Wood. Woodward. Chemist, London, that's a neat little bottle, nice aqua. I was digging and uh, I caught this with the shovel just to say and broke it. That was a nice little cobalt ink. Hello everybody, I pulled this one out, it's a, a nice little olive. And then I noticed there's another one in the hole still. I seen there was some shards, so I started uh, this little piece of a crown jar. Yeah. But there's another little jar bottle here too, probably an, an, an olive to match. So look at that. <laughs> cool. The matching uh, olives. Yeah, nice. Got this little bottle in the hole here. I'm not sure if it's just a slick. Looks to be. Pinex. Neat. So Willie's got himself a bottle in the hole here. A bottle in the plug. Bottle in the plug. Ooh. That is a Nerveline from Montreal. We'll take that. To calm your nerves. Everyone could use some of that right now. Willie figures he's got a bottle in the hole here. Cool. Nice. Got this little graduated med.
Hey guys, welcome to another episode. We're back out at the dump today. Got special guest Willie with us. We made ourselves a little tarp shanty. It's uh, outside. The weather's not panning out. Got a little bottle in the hole here. It looks like it might be purple. And a little med of some sort, not embossed. But I think it's a purple. This guy just popped out of the hole here. That is another graduated med. Hard to see. Might be a purple, but she kind of has that look. So the weather's been uh, improving. Willie uh, went out uh, from under the tarp, got himself a little slick there. Nice. Got himself a nice uh, aqua. It's got a pretty neat little top on it. I don't know if I've ever seen one of those. So it's a lesser. Leshire and Webbleton uh, Evans and, and Sons from London Liverpool in London cool That's a nice little score Oh Bottle in the hole and it's whole Nice little aqua, or is it kind of blue? Uh, aqua? Yeah. Oh, another mason jar lid, possibly scarred by the shovel, but... Just popped out uh, a plug here, and there was an actual coffin poison in there. Sweet. The day is made. Hope you guys uh, enjoyed this little bottle digging adventure. We'll see you next time.